All right, everybody, it's Kevin from stltechtalk.com here at the St. Louis Days of .net 13 here at the Mayor's Star Casino, and I'm sitting with Michael Gruen from mm -hmm. uh, Transitions. Correct. Mm -hmm. And Joshua Gruen, so I guess there's some relationship. There is indeed. There. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, sweet. So you guys are uh, gold sponsors of the conference. Mm -hmm. uh, tell us a little bit about your company, what it is that you know got you involved with the St. Louis Days of Dot sure. Conference. Well, we are a recruiting firm specializing in full-time contract and contract to hire placement and our primary expertise is in the Microsoft stack. So obviously a lot of that is .NET development, so we want to be where our audience is and where our targets are. Which is so, here. Right here. Definitely here. Perfect. And I know you guys got a prime location table where everybody's coming I know. In. You're right there in front of everybody. You had to play it the right way, but it worked out. Right. You can't come in <laughs> and you can't come out without seeing right. your table. Right. Perfect. Right. So Joshua, uh, what okay. do you do with the company? Uh, so I am kind of the junior recruiter. I just kind of, uh, I'm about a year in now. Okay. So still getting started. Um, what I do basically is I source candidates for a lot of the positions that we have open. Mm -hmm. So we work with a lot of uh, clients in the St. Louis area looking to hire new technical talent, IT talent. And basically when they have a need, we, we, we hear about it and they mm -hmm. give us a call. We talk to them about what they're looking for. And then it's my job to go find the people that fit. Okay. Uh, who would some of these clients in the St. Louis area be? We work with universities. We work with Fortune uh, 100 companies, mm -hmm. also some Fortune you know, 500 companies, if you will, so more medi medium tier and small organizations. Uh, the companies that we've worked with, some of them have done business with us for about 30 years now, wow. since our company's been around since 1975. Okay. So we have a long history of working yeah, with them. Yeah, a very established company. Yeah. Wow. Through three different company names, though, Sour right. Computer Systems, Analytics, and now Transitions. Yeah. That's, I mean, that's that's very good. That yeah, you're, you're very involved. So you you know you try to shoot for you know the universities, the the college students mm -hmm. getting ready to graduate with their degrees. And well, actually, more so the universities that are hiring positions for their accounting department or for their alumni departments or mm -hmm. you know various programs that need to be developed and campus wide uh, computing systems, for example. Uh, so we do a tremendous amount of work with the larger universities here in town. Wow. Yeah. Um, so where, I mean, you guys are located in St. Louis. We're in Clayton, actually. Clayton, yeah. okay, mm -hmm. so just not too far. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. Um, I mean, where do you kind of see the the current techno technological, you know, mm -hmm. area? Where, where are you seeing that, and where are you kind of seeing how that fits, and you know, what are your thoughts on, on that, per se? Well, I think the current market is going extremely well. Mm -hmm. So there is a tremendous lack of available talent. Uh, so we have to find different ways to encourage and uh, entice people to look at other positions. Right. Uh, so a lot of that's about career growth. I think that's the case at this point with software development, specifically in the .NET arena. Right. Because we were talking yeah. earlier with another guest, and he mentioned, you know, there's so many computer positions mm -hmm. coming open, mm -hmm. and then there's only so many people that's going to be graduating yep. to be able to fill those positions. And then if those people aren't really qualified, I mean, yeah, they have a degree, but yeah. are mm -hmm. they really good at what they do? That's another complete, mm -hmm. I mean, it just whittles the, the talent pool down even further. Correct. Mm -hmm. Which makes it very a very good thing to be in a, a development role mm -hmm. and to be very up on your skills and your capabilities, which I spoke about earlier today in a, in a session where I presented. You know, always keeping on top of the technolo technological curve mm -hmm. and staying on top of your game and uh, ensuring that you're looking out for the three to five year picture and moving your career in that direction. So I mean that was the focus of your, your mm -hmm. session, right? And, correct. And, and how I mean how was it? Was it pretty well received? Yeah, no, it's a great group. Good turnout and everything. Yeah, good turnout. Yeah. Had a good conversation. A lot of participation, which is necessary. Mm -hmm. We're talking about the ins and outs of you know marketing yourself as well and interviewing right. type of thing. Uh, yeah, we just you know we talked with Claire. As I mentioned you know kind of kind of like as you're focusing on your career, <clears throat> make sure you're focusing kind of on your you want to say brand and mm -hmm. like, you know have your blog do do your thing make sure you're you, know, you got the big picture you know yep. you got to be providing for the family but making mm -hmm. sure you're protecting yourself and yeah, your, your intellectual property and who yeah. you are so that whenever you know a career change is coming around and you're mm -hmm. you know, switching job positions or something or you want to go mm -hmm. out on your own completely and start your own thing yeah. you have a nice portfolio yep it's kind of yeah. like the other day I was thinking you know they always talk about you know, girls were the ones that would, you know, jotting in their journal, mm -hmm. writing their notes and all that stuff. It almost makes you wish everybody would you know, keep a journal of their their life history yeah. and 
Mm -hmm. That way you can always refer back to Well, and I think today you have more of that through all the different social media pieces that are out there. So sometimes you've got to be careful what you're putting out there. But um, have your private journal. There's a timeline these days, right? Right. Right. There's a time. So and we like to look at it in terms of where do you want your career to go Mm -hmm. and what are you really passionate about? What motivates you and how will you build out your current career to be marketable for tomorrow? Mm -hmm. So it's great to be where you are today. But are you in an organization that is uh, helping you? Uh, really grow and get to the pieces of technology, the components, or even the functional skills mm-hmm. that you think will be necessary to provide you with a better, well-rounded approach and a better, better offering for potential employers. Right. I mean, Josh, but you know, you're younger, obviously. <clears throat> mm-hmm. uh, I mean, what are your thoughts? I mean, I'm not sure how mm-hmm. old you are, but or <laughs> well, I'm 21 for the okay. Um, but so yeah, you've got a bright future ahead of you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, with still, everything. still young. But um, you got to basically think of yourself like the stock market, pretty much. Like you're a stock. Because, I mean, you don't, you got to make moves that are smart. You don't want to take something with, you know, a lot of risk because then it might not pay off. You don't want to let your value go down. You have to keep receiving that investment in yourself. So it's really about, you know, keeping on top of your portfolio yourself, you know, and then what kind of opportunities open up that right. come Ma- along, you know. Maintaining and looking at ways to grow. Right. Mm-hmm. To, you know, mm-hmm. always better yourself. You got to look at your track record, look what the market's doing, trying to keep current. Yeah. Great. Well, I do appreciate you guys for taking the time to sit down and speak with us. No problem. Uh, again, thank you very Michael, much. Michael, thank yep. you. Joshua, thank you again. Thank you. So, and it, really quick, where can they find you? You know, where can they find you ah, online? Transitionmethods.com. Transitionmethods.com. On Twitter is transitionsstl okay. or at 721-4610. Okay. Yeah. Or if you come by Clayton, we, we're in the building. We'll see you can rock climb up the front of it. 200 South Hanley, yeah. Okay. (laughs) All right. Perfect. So everybody, transitions. Thank you again. All right. Thank you.